Hey guys, welcome back to my RPG series. So we already have a player system in place with the player leveling up and a basic locomotion. So in my previous video, I asked for you guys to comment what next feature I should add. Uh, and I got a total of one comment. <laughs> so thank you freedom rules 416 so he says probably a health system to begin with and yeah fair enough so since i wanted something more complex so i went and asked a developer's next best friend for suggestions that's chat gpt so it has come up with many suggestions and the best i feel is this quantum health states so yeah let's go ahead so basically it says the player health is in a constant state of flux and hitting it will damage so much so i have so this gave me an idea of some type of mechanic so yeah let's go ahead and implement that so i started by creating two simple variables for the current health and the max health in unreal engine and set that default values to 100 so that will be the starting value then i went ahead and just created a simple function which makes the mac uh, makes the current health to a random value and i call that like every few seconds so and there we we have that a simple print string on the top left corner which changes which is our current health which is changing like every few seconds the next thing I wanted is to add more like a visual reference for that so that we still don't know what is happening. So I went ahead and created a simple UI, uh, as you can see, and it just makes it like a, uh, in the simple text blocks right now for showing, determining the values of our current and max health. So yeah, that looks good, but I wanted to get rid of the decimal values, so I went ahead and just rounded off the floats. And so there we had a simple health, which is uh, decreasing, uh, which is setting random values uh, every second. It can increase also, it can decrease as well. So the next what we wanted is a damage system. I don't have an AI enemy yet, but I'll be just implementing a function where if the player is hit, what will happen? So, so let's go ahead and start that. So right now I will be implementing that in a simple like key press. So whenever I press a key, the player is damaged. So I went ahead and created a, another simple custom event. And when I get damage, I'm setting my current health to the max health. And I went ahead and called that in a key press. And there you go when we play what we have right now is our health right now it's 100 or 142 i take damage and my max health sets to 42. so let's try that again so right now it's seven every few seconds is changing and now it's 31 39 i take damage and my max health is set to 39. so we are starting to develop some pretty interesting game mechanic here so now let's go ahead and i'll add a more better ui so that we understand so as you can see this will be a recurring theme i struggle a lot with ui what to add so i'll just keep this time lapse right now so that you all can enjoy the process of iterations i went through to create this ui So in the end, as you can see, after all that attempts, I settled with a basic health bar, which is default. So 
so yeah so i went ahead and decided to keep the health bar itself and then after a few iterations we had this simple health bar right now which is linked with the player health and uh, so this is how it looked so i had a health and every few seconds as you can see the player's health drops and upon taking damage and uh, the max health is set so yeah so the last thing left to do over here is you know add some simple math to this so that it looks quite nice right now it looks too rigid so again yeah so i went ahead added some curves some timelines few lerps here and there to just so that the health does not uh, decrease or increase or the max health is not set suddenly so went ahead did that for all the functions for a damage function as well as the health decreasing function so once i had that so i had this so yeah that's you go so i have a health bar so every few seconds you can see my health decreases or increases and upon taking damage my max health is set so pretty interesting do let me know if you all enjoyed this video also do let me know in the com comments if you all prefer this type of video or if you all need like full tutorials and also the thing is still open please comment and let me know what my next mechanic should be thank you